Okay guys, so welcome back. We are now going to be doing eyeliners. I have three in pots and I'm keeping all of these. This is the Anastasia waterproof creme color. Um, I do like this. I don't use, to be honest, gel liners are not my first choice. I prefer liquids, but I do keep this round to have and I do like it. These are two of the ColourPop ones. I don't know if you can get these shades anymore. This is DTLA, which is like a navy blue. I've used it once. I do like it. I mean, again, I don't really reach for the gel pots, which is why I only have a couple. I'm trying to change that. I'm trying to use them more. And this one's in the shade Brouhaha, which I think was collaborated with a YouTuber, but I can't recall who off the top of my head right now. And this is just a dark chocolate brown, which I do. Actually, I've used that one more than I've used the others. But yeah, there's that. I do have this, which I think I have to get rid of because I've had this for a lot longer than I care to actually admit. This is good for 24 months. <laughs> I think I bought this three years ago, so I'm just going to go ahead and toss it for safety reasons. I do love those though. The Urban Decay ones are fantastic. Um, I have this guy from Tarte. I got his gratis in my last month of Sephora. This is the Tartiste, the Tartist Clay Paint Liner in Black. I've used it a couple of times. It's okay. Um, it's, it's kind of a mess, but I do like it. I don't like the little brush that came with it, but I found a brush I did like. But again, I usually reach for liquids, but I'm going to keep this because I do like it. Um, This guy is the NYX Liquid Crystal Liner in the shade Crystal Silk. I do love this, especially at holiday time. This is brand new, as is this, so I'm going to keep both of these. These are two of the Too Faced Sketch Markers in um, Steel Blue and Smoky Emerald. I'm keeping both. I do also have that in Charcoal Black, which I love, and I do also have a black one. I had a black one. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Stay. Um, here's the black one. I'm also keeping this guy. Um, I am going to keep... Where's my Kat Von D? Trooper. Here you are. This is my favorite, favorite liquid liner of all time. I love the paintbrush tips over the felt tips. So I am going to keep this guy for sure. He's amazing. Um, Let's try my other Kat Von D's and see if they're still good. I don't know if Naruta is still... Naruta is still looking okay. So we're going to keep Naruta. Still nice and pigmented. Um, then I've also got Bukowski. This one might be dried. No, he's still going strong too. You go, dude. Then there is... I've got another one. Here it is. This one's in the shade Baudelaire. Which, you know, most people think of the poet. I think of freaking whatchamacallit. Series of unfortunate events. That's still working too. So these ones I'm definitely going to keep. I had a light blue one, but I guess I already tossed it. I don't remember doing that, but I guess I did. This is amazing as well. This is the Bare Minerals Lash Domination Ink Liner. It's just such a great pen. It's just very nice and precise. I do love this. I am keeping it. This I did not like. It kept drying out when I tried to use it. This is the Physician's Formula Eye Booster. I don't know if I just got a bad one. But my problem was it's just, it's not as pigmented. I, and it's kind of watery and I had a hard time getting it to be black. So I'm just going to go ahead and toss it. I'm literally chucking things in the bin now. Okay. I have two of these Stila um, waterproof eyeliners in black. I think this is the one that I had been using. This one, because it's all worn off. I'm going to assume. Yeah, he's kind of dying. I'm going to go ahead and toss this one. And you know what? I'm going to toss this one too because I think I've just had it for too long. It's also kind of on the faint side. Goodbye. This is the Soap and Glory Super Cat Liner. I love this liner. I think it's fantastic, actually. But he's unfortunately dying. Goodbye. He's dying too. Speaking of Stila, this is the Stila one in Emerald. Mm. It works. Let me compare it to the Too Faced one that I just got, because I only need one green liquid liner. Uh, I mean, they're different colors. 
I'll keep both for now, but I might get rid of the Stila one later. Um, I have this. This is the NYX Glam Liner Aqualux in Glam Nude. I think I just have to toss this one because I think it's just gone bad. It's like a really interesting metallic, but I think it's gone bad. It's, I've had it for a while. Bye. This one is the Aqualux liner in black, I believe. Glitter black or glam black or something like that. Oh, that's just, nope, it's gross. Goodbye. He's all gloppy and gross. So, done. I have three of these Urban Decay liquid razors. I don't think these have dried out. They shouldn't have dried out. Let's see. Yeah, that one's still good. This one is in the shade, I think, Zodiac. Yep, this one's in Zodiac. It's kind of, it looks brown, but it reflects green and purple. This one is in Push, which is like a navy blue. Ooh, still beautiful. Keeping that one. Those are looking really good. And then there's this one in Gold Rush. Ooh, that's Beautiful, I'm keeping that. Hell yeah. Look at that gold. Get it, catch that light there, that's gorgeous. Okay, like my little, looks like I'm doing tally marks on my hand. Okay, the last liquid one I have is this one and I think I'm just gonna get rid of it. This is the NYC liquid eyeliner. Everyone loves this and I don't. I just, it is very pigmented, it is very black, but this is just too thick of a brush. They put too many bristles on it for me to like it, so I'm just gonna toss it. I'm gonna really quickly clean my hand off so I can do pencils. This one I'm gonna keep just because I wanna use it up. This is, most of these are NYX. Um, this is the NYX one in White Pearl, which I love. Definitely keeping that. I have this one in gold, which is like a twist up one. I think this one, ooh, it's more like a dark gold. Anything I'm tempted to keep, I'll just put here and think about it for a minute. This I'm gonna get rid of. This is the CoverGirl Liquiline Blast. I don't know what color this is. This is just gonna go away. I have this one from Jante Bleu in the shade Electric Bleu. Spelled the French Y. That's pretty. I might hold on to that. Problem is, I probably should have separated these by color. This is the only gold pencil I have, so you know what? I'm gonna keep the gold one for sure. Let's swatch some other blues while I'm swatching a blue. This one's NYX in Gypsy Blue. Which I remember correctly, is more like a teal blue. Oh no, it's the dark blue. Yeah, I don't know. I have this one from Jordana, which is in Blue Divine. And I have this one from NYX, which is in Sapphire. Okay, to be honest, the only one I want to keep is that Jantin Bleu, the bright blue one. And I kind of want to keep the Jordana one just because it's a standard dark blue, but I think I'm going to get rid of both the NYX ones. My goal is to be able to fit all of these in one section, but I doubt that, so we'll see. Um, let's move on to purple. I have this one from NYX in Deep Purple. Which is, you know, just typical purple. I have this one from Jordana, which is an eggplant. Which is a little bit smokier. And then I'm gonna label this as purple. I don't think it actually is, but this is in the shade Jewel Bijou, which is pretty. You know, I think I'm just gonna keep, no, I'm not gonna keep any of these because I, I, I don't really, I need one purple. I need to keep one purple. I'm gonna keep the first NYX one, the one in deep purple and get rid of these two. I'm doing good. It's gonna be hard when we get to black. Oh, I do have another gold. This one's in the shade Velvet. Oh, totally not the same color. Keeping that, this is more of like a bronze. Okay, 
green. Let's do green. I've got two greens. I have the L'Oreal Sikisme, Sikisme, I don't know, in green ivy. Which is like a nice smoky olive. I kind of like that. And then I have this one in moss. I actually might keep both of those because I like them both for different reasons. Let's keep both. Let's do brown. I have the Rimmel Exaggerate Smoke and Shine in Kappa Bling. Yeah. And I have the next one in Cafe. I'm going to get rid of the Cafe one and keep the Rimmel one. Let's do nude. I have the Rimmel one in nude, in the nude. And then I also have the NYX Wonder Pencil in light, which I think I'm gonna keep that one and get rid of the Rimmel. And then I have three black ones. This one is brand new. This is the LA Girl Glide Gel Liner. I'm gonna keep that because it is new. I have the Hikari, I don't know, it's in black. Um, it's a little thick for my liking. I might just pass on that. This is the Sokisme and actually charcoal, it's not in black. Oh, it's like black with glitter. Nah, I'm just getting rid of that. And then this one's the Makeup Forever Aqua XL in M10. This I will keep, I do like it, it needs to be sharpened nice dark matte black okay that was pretty good i did pretty good okay. i'm getting rid of 16 31 and i got rid of 16 so uh, that's pretty good for me considering i don't use a whole lot of liner liners and i didn't get a lot of the liquid ones gone which are the ones that i tend to use not that surprising so yeah i'm pretty happy with that kept 31 got rid of 16. we'll go with that so, as always, like I tell you guys in all these videos, if there's an eyeliner that you didn't see me mention that you want to see me try out, please tell me down below. I know the Marc Jacobs ones are on my list to try out soon, um, once I decide what color I want to finally get. Um, and, as always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!